I know you want the wall. We're going to get the wall. If we don't get the wall, uh, you're going to have a lot of very unhappy people, starting with me. That was President Trump touting the commitment of the new DHS secretary to strengthening border security. CBS 4's Priscilla Estrada is live in Hidalgo and tells us about Secretary Kirsten Nielsen's message on border security for the Valley. Nicole, the DHS secretary spent her visit touring the air, marine and field operations right here in the valley. She says while there are great efforts, there's still a lot that needs to be done to secure the nation's borders. We are going to make it very, very difficult to remain here unlawfully. With only a week in office, the Department of Homeland Security Secretary Kirsten Nielsen is cracking down on border security, starting right here in the Rio Grande Valley. That's because southwest borders account for 46 percent of apprehensions. Even as we apprehend illegal aliens, decades of systemic policy failures make it almost impossible to fully carry out the law. Our immigration courts are backlogged by more than 600,000 cases. Nielsen stresses the fact that a single immigration case takes nearly two years, all while the undocumented immigrant remains in the United States, oftentimes disappearing into communities. To help, DHS plans to hire 1,000 ICE attorneys, 370 immigration judges, and 10,000 new ICE officers. Currently, there are nearly one million aliens who have been ordered by a federal judge to be removed from the country. Nielsen says while illegal crossings are down by 30 percent, there are other issues like the 68 percent increase in Border Patrol agent assaults, the explosion in asylum claims, and the alarming increase in unaccompanied minors and family units entering the United States. And we're finding various ways to deter that. It's a tremendously dangerous journey to get here through smugglers, through traffickers, through coyotes. Uh, it is both a humanitarian mission and a security issue. So we're looking to bring those numbers back down. Along with the president, DHS is even considering a border wall in the Rio Grande Valley, starting at Santa Ana National Wildlife Refuge Center once funding is complete. Um, 35 gates have been funded already. The money is uh, allocated to cover you know, the gaps that we have uh, currently. Um, the planning is 60 miles of border wall fence combination. 28 of those miles will be in Hidalgo County. Uh, 32 miles of those will be in Sark County. Those are in the planning phase, not funded yet. Nielsen says the administration's 2018 fiscal year budget allots $1.6 billion for a new border wall system. But obstacles to overcome before building are partnerships with landowners, state and local authorities, as well as assessing the environmental effects. When asked about when we could expect to see construction of a border wall here in the valley, neither Padilla or Nielsen could give us an exact time frame. But as of right now, several border wall prototypes are being tested in California. Live in Hidalgo with complete valley coverage, Priscilla Estrada, CBS4 Valley, tonight.